So, hey guys, Pollux and I are here. It is Friday, October the 29th, and our website launches tomorrow. So, I kind of wanted to show you behind the scenes what we're doing, what I'm doing to get ready for you and your purchases tomorrow. All right, Pollux, it's raining here. Pollux is not super happy about it. And Maxie is actually in hiding. I want to show you this sweet boy. When it rains, Maxie runs to the utility room. Right, Mooey, let me turn on the light. Mooey, it's gonna be bright. I'm sorry. <laughs> so I bring his bed in here and his blanket and he just takes a big Judy. Oh my goodness, your beard is squished. But anyway, he is just in here sleeping because it's raining. Sorry, Moo, go back to sleep. I'm sorry. I have been home all day, working on the website, making sure everything works and checks out. Selling merchandise is no joke, y'all. It really is a big deal. You all know my office and the hole in the couch, thanks to Maxie. But here is my setup. My computer's all ready, and I do everything on my Shopify store. And this is how many people have been to the website today trying to buy merchandise and the site doesn't even launch until tomorrow. I've been test printing our shipping labels. I got a brand new shipping label printer, but let's head upstairs to where the merchandise is. Pollux, do you want to go upstairs and show them? You know that my daughter's left for college. Randy and I, oh, now he's going to come with me. Come on, boo. Randy and I are now empty nesters. So... I turned Brecken's bedroom into my little shipping warehouse. Well, here it is. This is my shipping warehouse slash Brecken can't come home because her bedroom looks like this now. I've got all of the Pollux and Maxi sweatshirts folded and sorted by size. Then there's Take a Judy. And this is dog hair everywhere. Mixed in with some of Brecken's stuff that she left here. Like Winnie the Pooh. But this is my setup. I am ready to go. I've got my little shipping station set up here because, of course, I have to weigh everything. I've got my poly bags. Thank you stickers for the bags. And these are the special thank you cards that are going inside every order. But this is what the thank you cards look like. And on the back, there's just a little something for me and Maxie and Pollux. I hope because tomorrow was a Saturday and we're gonna go live at nine o'clock in the morning. So I'm gonna spend the first hour or two just kind of watching the sales and see what goes on. And then my plan is to come up here and start packaging all of your orders. I would love to have all of your orders out the door within a week. I don't know if that's possible, but I'm sure gonna try. So let me just kind of fill you in on what is involved in creating merchandise to sell online. So I, designed all of the t-shirts that you ever buy from me. I designed them myself. I come up with the idea and I sit down with the graphic designer at our graphic uh, printing house here. And she and I work back and forth to get the design exactly the way that I want it. I tell them what merchandise I want printed. In the past, we've done short sleeve t-shirts, baseball tees, hoodies. These are just regular sweatshirts this time. And so I tell them, what do I want? I pick out the actual garment, the sizes, they order samples for me. I try everything on to make sure that the fit is correct. And there have been times that I have ordered samples. I didn't like it. I didn't like the way it fit. I wasn't happy with the colors. So once we get all of the specifics work out, I have to place an order. I, out of my own pocket, have to pay for all of this and so i decide in my budget what am i willing to spend how many sweatshirts is that going to get me and i actually place an order so when i go to pick up my order and i have to hand my guy a check i almost fall out about every time because y'all it is a lot of money i spend a lot of money on all of the merchandise because i do good merchandise. I make sure that it is good quality. It fits well. The designs are on point. Like I spend a lot of time and effort and I do spend my own money. So it really is a very long process to get to this point, to get to where we actually have like merchandise in hand. I'm going to head downstairs. Like I said, I use Shopify and their platform is not free. Pollux. 
what did you do, buddy? <laughs> He's in Kendall's room on her bed, and I had all of these blankets washed and stacked up over here, and you pulled them all on the floor. Look at you turning your head. You're busted, dude. Yeah, you're busted. What are you doing on Kendall's bed? So Kendall's gonna be home for Thanksgiving, and I gotta get up here and clean her room. But if y'all saw the video from the other day, <laughs> this room was a disaster. I did come up here. I cleaned up her room. Still haven't cleaned the bathroom, but I've gotten everything at least organized. And then Mr. Hoo Hoo here pulled all the blankets on the floor. Right, Pollux? Sheesh. Okay, so what I was saying, the billing platform that I use, Shopify, is not free. I have to pay a monthly fee to use that. I have to pay a monthly fee for, it's like an add-on, the app that I use <laughs> to send you all emails. There is a pretty substantial monthly fee involved in the website itself. Pollux, can you clean this up, please, so we can go downstairs? Can you, can you clean it up, buddy? And I, I'm walking and talking because I have to be at work at the ice. <laughs> Do y'all see him? He's following me with that blanket. Pollux, what are you doing? He, um, he acts like he doesn't see me talking to him. Pollux, we'll see if he follows me. <laughs> I have to be at work in 30 minutes at the ice cream shop, so that's why I'm kind of talking fast. And he puts it in his bed. Oh my goodness. When we got home from the beach, I washed his bed and I put it right there. This was yesterday and this is where he's been pretty much all day long in the rain and now he's got his blankie in there. Buddy, you're so sweet. But tomorrow, on October 30th, when the website goes live at 9 a.m., I'm going to be sitting right here at my computer. I'm going to be watching everything live. I have put weeks and months into all of this merchandise from the time that I decided to do it until now. And knowing that tomorrow is launch day, so much time and effort has gone into the merchandise. I hope you all love it. I love it. I'm going to work tonight knowing that my website is ready and I'm going to see you tomorrow morning. So have a great night. I'm going to go sell some ice cream and then I'll meet you back here 9 a.m. October 30th. See you in the morning. So good morning, y'all. It's Saturday morning, October 30th. <laughs> it's early. Pollux and I are up. I'm dressed. He is just curled up in a little ball because it is cold and rainy outside. Maxie actually went back to bed with Randy. They are still asleep. Hey, sir, we're on camera. Can you not do that? <laughs> But we are dressed and ready. We've got we've got 15 minutes till the website goes live, and I think I'm ready to go. I'm super excited. I cannot wait to see you all on the website. 8:44, and already 77 people have been to the website this morning waiting for me to go live. So 8:53. This is a map of who is on the website right now live. And all these little green dots are you all, and the blue dot is me. As soon as I uncheck this, the side is live. I'm ready. Are y'all ready? I'm gonna uncheck it. Here we go. Your store is live. Oh my gosh. Okay, I have seven visitors on the site. You can see where everybody is from. Of course, everybody's taking a moment because they've never seen the site. They gotta figure their way around and start deciding what they want. So right now, two people have merchandise in their cart. One person's in the process of checking out and who is gonna be our first purchase. Look, I can see where y'all are from. Liberty, North Liberty, Queens. This is so cool. This Shopify platform, it really is fantastic. See, look, I can see who's on their mobile phone. It'll tell me when somebody's on a desktop. Oh, boop. somebody made a purchase. Martina, thank you so much. You are the very first customer of the day. Pollux. <laughs> He's pretty chilled out, but he thanks you too. Martina, you're in Louisville, Kentucky. Hey, we're neighbors. <laughs> Here's the update. It is 9.06 a.m. These are all of the people on the website. Right now, I have 15 visitors 
and this is what's happening. People have stuff in their carts. Seven people are in the process of checking out. Three orders are complete. Look at you way up here. Okay, y'all, California, you are up early. What are you doing up so early? Please tell me you didn't get up for me. <laughs> San Diego. What do you think about it, Pollux? Are you watching with me? He's watching with me. Right, you're watching with me. <laughs> We're in our pajamas, covered in dog hair, by the way. Oh, what are you doing? Pollux, I'm busy right now, boo. Go get Maxie. Hey, go wake up Maxie. Maxie, you want on to bed with Dad? Okay, hold on. Wait. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's what these guys are doing. Randy's still in bed. And these two love to play on him in the mornings. <laughs> Good morning. I'm starving. I gotta have my oatmeal. <laughs> Okay, back to the computer. Print and pack and slips. I could have printed them on my little printer here, but they were so small, so I'm gonna, y'all, I don't see well, so I'm gonna do a full piece of paper. <laughs> y'all wanna know the best part? Watch this. love this new little printer. Well, if this isn't exciting, I don't know what is, y'all. I'm upstairs. I just, I'm starting to package orders. I had to do a couple to just get in the groove. I got a whole stack of orders ready to go. I'm kind of doing them like 10 at a time. I gotta just, there's a lot of checks and balances that I have to do before the orders can like go in the bag and I seal up the bag. I know you want to see me pack some orders, so I'm just gonna let the camera go and pack away. You were such a good helper, weren't you? You were. You were a real good helper. He was holding down the floor right here supervising. Yep, you ready to keep going, boo? We got lots more to do. I want to say a huge thank you to Martina in Louisville, Kentucky. You were the very first order of the day. You were the first one I've done. Some of you all have sent me DMs on Instagram saying that you placed your order. I see you. I promise, Sarah, I see you. So I sent you a DM back with a pick of your order. So Randy went to get me lunch. I'm going to get to packing orders. I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to everybody that placed an order. I truly appreciate your support. This is what allows me to keep doing what I'm doing and to be home and to make YouTube videos. Well, let me back up. Be home during the day to make YouTube videos. 
because at night I'm at the ice cream shop. But regardless, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. If you placed an order, as soon as I create the shipping label for you, you will get an email with the tracking number and that means your order is on the way. Thank you guys.